All right, so you also got in your kit a little wire that looks like this. Now again, this is when having the needle nose pliers um, can be of a benefit, but it's not mandatory. So I now have my wreath with sign on, all the ribbon and everything. I'm going to kind of mark, you know, kind of here's the top and flip over. So I'm gonna make a little hoop like this and I'm gonna run my wires underneath. I'm gonna twist them and run one through. And like I said, this is when needle nose pliers are of the most benefit, but again, they are not mandatory. You can do this with your fingers. It just is a bit more challenging and you don't tend to get it as tight, but it will still work. So I'm just gonna twist it up through the hoop and twisting it around. So I've now got both of these guys going through the hoop from different directions and I'm going to tighten it down onto the wire. Now you don't have to use the metal wire. Um, you certainly can you just use the, the rim of the wreath to hang on a hook and what works really well are just the little 3M hooks um, to hang it. All right now we've got the wire on. Now it's time to finesse again, because as you can see, they've gotten squished. So you're gonna just come along and again, kind of pull out. And there are a ribbon that gets tucked underneath. And so you can pull those out. You can also tuck something in. You can say, I want to see this, these cute Santa feet. You know, I can make sure that I pull them so that they're overlying. Um, or if I really want this candy cane to overlap, I can do that too. So you can kind of just play with it. Um, there, and again, you will drive yourself insane if you, so at some point you have to just say uncle and walk away <laughs> because otherwise you'll be doing this um, constantly. But I do like to kind of make sure, and even that's flipped over, it does get going the right direction. You know, so you can appreciate all the different ribbons because that's what makes it so fun and unique is having all that. Now you see here's where I kind of overlap those Santas and they're right next to each other. But I can always tuck one under and then have that kitty cane stripe hang out. And you know, so there's, um, you can just have fun with it. Um, And sometimes you may want to turn the mesh around and that's fine too, you know. Again, mesh sticks to everything. All right, I'm coming down off my stool so I can do this better. Um, so just play with it, it's make it the way you want and don't overanalyze it because it will take, you'll be here forever and it'll never be exactly perfect because it's not meant to. It's meant to be, there's another, ah, oh, back here. Um, it's not meant to be perfect. It's meant to be unique and you know, no two of these are gonna look exactly alike. There are, there's gonna be variety. And if you're worried about some of that, you know, fishing line showing, you just move the ribbon around. Um, but there. All right. Done. That's it. Hope you enjoyed. Um, I hope this all made sense. Please let me know if you have trouble with anything. Um, feedback always would help me so that I could teach others. So um, have a Merry Christmas, and I hope you enjoy your um, festive holiday wreath for the entire season and years to come.